<laughs> married? You, you, didn't say, you didn't say married. Married? You, you can't get married. I know a good caterer. Mother! <laughs> Wait a minute. There's no way you can get married. There's just no way you can get married. Uh, Dad, it's not like we're going to get married tomorrow. No, tomorrow you'll be picking out a, a cheap coffin to bury me in on Boot Hill. <laughs> Wait a minute. I can't catch my breath. Don't you worry, sir. I'm trained in CPR. Wait a minute. <laughs> Don't you touch me. You're the one who's killing me. Tony, are you going to eat those chips? <gasps> Tony, Tony, I think maybe you should sit down. No, I'm, I'm okay now. I'm, I'm much better. I'm in control. Oops. Gotta go. Emergency? Samantha's pregnant. <gasps> Dad, it's his mare. He named her after me. Oh, no. Maybe I should stay. No. Go, go, and ride like the wind. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Here's what we're gonna do. First, we're gonna rename that horse. <laughs> then, I'm gonna throw Sam over my saddle and ride east until I hit pavement. What you have to do is relax so that you don't say something you're going to regret later. You're right. You're right. That's why you're here. You're the voice of reason. Use your voice. Talk to Sam. Sam, Angela wants to talk to you. Talk to her. Uh, well, uh, Sam, are you sure you want to get married now? You're so young. Young? Good, good, young. <laughs> I didn't say a word. Max, 21, and I'm 18. You were just as young when you got married. Well, yes, but my marriage was not a great success. But, Angela, we're in love. You can understand that, can't I you? I do, I do, but what about college? I've got plenty of time. Like you said, I'm young. I know I said that. And we're in love. I know you said that. But, Sam, there is a big difference between love and getting an education. Well, Matt says I could just go to college here. Well, Matt may be right, but what, what, what about your scholarship? What are you going to do for money? We both work full time. It's cheaper to live out here. I know it's cheaper to live out Matt here. Said... I don't care what Matt says. This is real life, not Little House on the Prairie. Now, pack your bags. We are taking your teenage butt home. Excuse me, uh, but I, I think the voice of reason is shrieking. <laughs> she is destroying her life. She is destroying... She is throwing it away on a tall drink of water in cowboy boots. It's crazy. It's nuts. And this furniture is giving me splinters. <laughs> Wait, 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 I'll be right back. Oh, I'll keep my eye on the child bride. Don't say bride. <laughs> it doesn't matter what I did. See, it doesn't matter if I got married young. So what if I got married young? If I jumped off a cliff, would she jump off a cliff? All right, Angela, <laughs> relax. Relax. Here. Here, have, have a seat. Have a seat. Oh. <sighs> what? What? What can she be thinking? I don't know. You can't talk to her. You can't yell at her. You can't send her to a room. It's 2,600 miles away. <laughs> you know, I was always able to talk to her, to have an, an open exchange with her, to make her see that my way was right. <laughs> wow. What? Those colors. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that, that's the most beautiful sunset I've ever seen. Is that an eagle? Holy smoke. Gee, now I know what Sam was talking about. Now I understand why she'd want to build a life for herself out here. Gee, I, I think I'm going to cry. <laughs> so you're OK with her and Matt? Get real. It's a sunset and a bird. You don't build a life on that. <laughs> Wait, where are you going? Sometimes a man's got to do what a man's got to do. Sometimes a man's got to walk. 